coffee. Coffee no! We want to interview the moms, the marching, what, Million Mom March, or whatever they are. You know where they are? Down there, maybe? We have no yeah, idea where they are. Roger that. We can't even find them. So we're going to go look for them and ask them a few questions about why they like gun control, why they like statistically more deaths, and why they like Mexico. So, But we're trying. We can't even find them anywhere. Are you the head of the local organization? No, I'm not. I'm the head of the local organization. Hey, how you doing? I'm Alex Jones. Hi, how are you doing? Good, good, good. Yeah. Hi. So so tell us, tell us about what you're doing here today. Well, I'm, is this... I would prefer to um, to have just a moment to talk to you off camera before we, you know, you bring your cameras in to our event. Is that okay? Well, he's he's just right there. No, I he's not. In, it's it's just First Amendment. You're a public group. We're just wondering. I thought this was to raise awareness. If crime rates have dropped 49 percent since 1992 yes. because of gun ownership increasing. Why we want to be like Mexico, where they've taken all the guns, they have the highest crime rate in the world, or Chicago? Okay, I'm not going to stand here and be bullied by you into having a conversation that you know, um, is Mr. not. Whoa, Edward, no, whoa, I you just, whoa, your hand. she just yes. rammed into me. Oh. I know I came over to ask you to please. Wow, you just, that, that's like assault. Oh, yeah, is it Isn't this a public event? Why did you touch me? Because you I don't like you. You don't like me? No. Why? Why did you leave her alone? We're having a peaceful time here. Well, I just don't Your want anybody time. to touch me. You already slammed into me. You're not going to touch I me, are you, sir? Go Thank away. You. We don't want you here. We don't want you. What, what's wrong? We were so friendly. What public event is this if you don't want any exposure? We thought you wanted press. We're press. We're here to be friends. Okay, Ronnie, go. It went really well. We're going to have more of them. We're going to take our civil rights back. You're taking your civil rights? Just like in 1776. Who took, your, who took your civil rights? They've taken the guns in Chicago, New York, D.C. They're uh, taking your guns? Feinstein says the goal is to ban all the guns. It says right here. Nobody's trying to take your toys. They Nobody. Haven't, they haven't taken ban the guns? Assault weapons. Ban no assault weapons. No one trying to take They're the guns. not trying to. It says right here. Wait, wait, wait. Assault That's all semi-auto. Shut up and let me talk. Oh, yes, ma'am. You are not. You are not saying that correctly. We want to ban, a, she wants to ban assault Who's weapons she? in the, Diane Feinstein, you're the one that brought her up. But, but Bloomberg wants a total ban. Wait, 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 wait. But they don't want ha, to confiscate have they people that are. Did they confiscate guns in New Orleans? Picking up every one of them. M Mr. and Mrs. America, turn them all in. I would have done it. Have they banned the guns in Chicago and New York and D.C.? No, they have not. They have not banned the guns. You do not want our guns. That's, that's, well, good. We want your guns. Good. We so, don't want you here. Santa Ana wanted the guns. In reality and statistics, you're very upset. We're very sorry no. that we brought facts and reality. What about the 49% drop in violent crime since 1992 because of gun ownership don't going up? I, I'm a libertarian. Shake my hand. Come on. Want a hug? How about a hug? How about a hug? Come on. Come on, I support. Yeah, here, here. We're being nice about this whole thing. Yeah, how about be friends? Here. No. What's your name? Matt. Matt. Yeah. Matt. Listen, you know Hitler was for gun control. It's gonna be 1776 again, isn't it? Well, like 1776? well, we're trying to avert. The we're, conversation. We're trying to avert 1776. Once you bring up Hitler, you're obviously not serious about the conversation. Oh, no, but Lenin, right? Lenin and Stalin Lenin and Mao, and Stalin, Hitler, it's just, Santa Ana, they all came to take the guns. Yeah, Governments like, don't try to take the guns. Uh, well, here's the thing. People that like gun control had, ban them all in like Chicago, New York, and D.C. So, so why wouldn't we think that there's really a plan to register them and take them if they've taken them other places? Real question. Why do you assume I'm for that? Uh, no, no, but I'm saying the bills they're trying to move forward. The mayor pro team of Austin said, once we register your guns, we will confiscate them. That there is no gun ban currently, but because of the work that we're doing here today, we will make your side legitimate shortly, so you hang on to that. You may be one of the more moderate members, but that's the plan. It says, it says ban assault weapons, which is even semi-automatic, and ammunition magazines that hold more than 10 rounds. This is, this is a Bloomberg. You guys don't take money from Bloomberg. No money from Bloomberg. Your rally that you think was so successful, it's so well accepted in Texas. It's not accepted nationwide. And that'll be used to get guns other places. I know, but here's the deal. We are desensitizing people. Just like you guys say, the Attorney General said we've got to brainwash people that guns can't even be seen. 
in the hands of citizens. So we're not brainwashing, we're reversing. We're openly saying, look, we have a right to own guns. I don't want people walking around with assault rifles on their backs, walking into Walmart, Starbucks. I, we don't need But that. you like cops with guns everywhere. Yes, I Can want I the cops to question? have guns. Here's the deal, yes. we're going to have the guns everywhere, and if you guys try to take them, I don't 1776. Want to, I want <laughs> you, you, you know guys, what a gun grab is? It's something that nobody in this country wants. If I could have gotten 51 votes in the Senate of the United States for an outright ban, picking up every one of them, Mr. and Mrs. America, turn them all in, I would have done it. A gun grab is something that nobody in this country well, wants. Well, sir, all I can say is you are really getting in my space, like your wife came over and pushed up against well, me. Why don't you back up? No, I'm not going to back up. Good. You're the one got in my space. You know look what? at this. Look at this guy. Stop. All right, go ahead. Stop. You, you, Stop. Listen, I don't want to beat an old guy up, so don't touch me, all right? This guy could take just... you out in a heart. I bet he could. Here. I'm not violent. Why do you think it's okay to sell a gun to someone that you don't know that's not been through a background check? Should we have a, should we have a background check for bathtubs every time we take a bath? We should have a background check oh. for guns. Should we have a background check for knives? You don't believe in a background well, check? No. Have you heard about We all know it's a killer. registration. We have your documents. Have you read the bill 1565 that says it's against the law to keep a registration and it's a $15,000 fine But they've fine caught them keeping it. They've caught them keeping it. I what do you think about myself. knives? I mean, there's Bonnie, a knife sweetheart. assault. You're giving them what they want. Don't do it anymore. Listen, don't listen to the facts, don't listen to the statistics. Just yell at us and well, call us names. That thing. is the only thing that works. Did you know assault rifles are using 2% of crimes? I know an assault rifle was used to murder my daughter in Aurora. I know that. Well, I'm sorry that... Yeah, you're, you're sorry. Not. I didn't curse no, your daughter. I mean, that's the big issue is there's probably five people here against the guns. And they're, and they're claiming, it's probably true, there's a guy a lot of sadness in his eyes, that it's his loved one that was lost at Aurora and that that's basically our fault. And the, and the media is preying on these victims of gun control and gun-free zones like movie theaters, schools, and military bases, where the SWAT team was ordered to stand down at the Naval Yard. They are preying on us. And they're preying on people that have had loved ones that are lost in our pain to then blame others that have the right to self-defense when overall in the aggregate, guns are saving more lives than they're losing by 40 plus percent to one. If you look at just just 20 years ago, it was 20 plus times a gun was used to stop crime or murder. Now it's 40 plus times on average. And so I'm like, here's the average. I'm sorry bad stuff happens. It's like cars. God forbid my daughter die in a car wreck. I'm not going to then go out. Uh, if it's a drunk driver, then I'm going to blame him. I'm not going to blame Ford or Chevy. He just poured his beer on you? Yeah, they just poured the beer on them. That's the aggressiveness. Coffee. Coffee, no!